Today, we're going to look at how construction companies are managing their risk and the lessons it holds for other industries. Many construction projects are completely behind schedule or over budget, and these overruns can be very significant. The East Side Access Project in New York City is a very good example of this. The goal of this project is to extend the Long Island Railroad from Queens into a new station under Grand Central Terminal in Manhattan. The project's estimated cost has escalated from $4.3 billion in 1999 to, as of April 2018, a cost of $11.1 billion, almost triple the original estimate and making it the most expensive construction project of its type in the world. The reasons for ballooning costs were due to several factors, including poor management, lack of oversight, as well as fraud. Other critical risks in construction industry are design changes, weather delays, as well as execution delays due to suppliers and subcontractors. Poor project planning is often behind delays and cost overruns and can be a result of delusions or the unintentional mistakes of project planners due to motivational biases. These types of mistakes are most prevalent in smaller projects. For example, due to optimism bias, planners often think that a project has much less risk and can be completed faster and at a lower cost. In large projects, the source of cost and schedule overruns are often due to deception or the intentional attempt of project planners or sponsors to create plans that have a reduced cost and duration with the goal of getting the projects approved. Deception is often expressed as unrealistic reductions in the probability and impact of some risks and ignoring others. One of the solutions to reduce the negative impact of these cognitive and motivational biases is project risk analysis. To perform quantitative project risk analysis, you need two sources of information, a project schedule and a risk register. Risks are assigned with probabilities and impacts to different activities in the schedule. Then, Monte Carlo simulations are performed. The results are analysis of the statistical distributions of project cost, finish time, and other project parameters such as ranking and prioritizing risks in the risk register. Project risk analysis for construction schedules involves integrated analysis of project schedule and cost. Accurate project risk analysis is critically important during competitive bidding. Construction companies should have a certain confidence level that they will complete the project within the schedule and budget. In this example, without risk, the project should be completed in 210 days. However, the P80 confidence level for the completion is 282 days. So to meet the com company's risk tolerance of P80, we'll require an additional 72 days of margin to account for the risk. Project owners are also seeing the value of project risk analysis as it gives them the opportunity to assess risk adjusted forecasts for project duration and cost prior to the bidding process and allows them to verify the feasibility of the bids. When performing risk analysis, costs can also be analyzed by assigning risks to resources. For example, if one subcontractor is less productive or having quality issues, this will affect all tasks that involve the subcontractor. Resource risk impacts include duration, allocation, or rates, all of which can impact both task duration and cost. Most construction schedules include many parallel paths. For deterministic project schedules, critical path method identifies one critical path through the schedule. In Monte Carlo simulations, a critical path calculation is performed on each iteration. Because each iteration can model different task durations, the results of the simulation can produce multiple critical paths. The criticality index indicates the frequency at which a task is on the critical path during the simulation. Tasks with a higher criticality index have the most potential to affect the final project finish time and should be the focus of management efforts. 
The control process is a critical part of the project management. Project risk analysis performed on each phase of the project helps to forecast project completion dates while accounting for risks and uncertainties as well as actual duration of the completed portion of the project. For more information, please read our book, Project Risk Analysis, Made Ridiculously Simple. It is a step-by-step -step guide to project risk analysis. Please visit our website, Intabor.com, and subscribe to our channel.